Chudley Cannons, Chudley Cannons, boom, 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 we are not pirates. Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Calling Gaming Super Smash Brothers Spring Break Bowser Amiibo Challenge. We have uh, defeated one lone amiibo. It was Zero Suit Samus, aka Catwoman. We got close to defeating Horntail in the last episode. Yeah, I pretty much gave away a life. Uh, but let oh. me tell you something, me and Ben, in the off season between episodes, have been training our butts off against Cloud here. My God. He is it's, virtually he is, unbeatable. He is so good. If we happen to <laughs> beat him in Live. one of these episodes that we're recording, oh my gosh. Oh my God. I might, like, be... I might take a, a digital frame and put it on my desk <laughs> and just have it on a loop <laughs> at all yeah. times. Oh, oh man. That being said, I don't even know if he's the best one. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. We haven't even we haven't even gotten Joran or Professor X yet. Or I don't even know if we've gotten Cloud on the channel. So We did. We did? Okay. Yeah. So two we of these rocked. we haven't gotten yet. <laughs> we got rocked? Okay. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Very good. Uh, by the way, just quick schedule update in case you haven't been watching the Nuzlocks or anything like that. The way we're doing it uh, while the Nuzlocke is running is we're going to have Smash on Monday and the Nuzlocke on Wednesday, Friday. And then uh, if you want more Smash, you can sign up for our Patreon and get an extra bonus episode on Saturdays where we just sort of like answer more fun questions and less advice questions. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <coughs> so there's all that. Anyway... Uh, Jordan, what order are we playing in today? All right, well, we are playing Derek Goes First. Woo! Oh, Derek! I shall game. hand you the controller. Derek. Derek, who shall be his foe? I rolled a four. Oh, no. That is Bowser. 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 More like Boozer, am I right? <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> more like Jowser, I'm pretty uh, sure. Jokes. Okay. Uh, Oh, whoops, hold on, I think we have to do... Oh, because that's another controller. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Other controllers. There yep. it is. Boop, boop. Yep. Okay, oh my goodness. Well, this is going to be a short episode, probably. Right. I mean, or we're going to be awesome. Yeah, you're just going to totally rock him. Exactly. Uh, great. Uh, what should, uh, I think sure. you're going to want... Or, yeah, hit those arrows. I'm thinking know. either Dark Pit or, Bala or Donkey Kong. To have some like King Kong versus Godzilla action happening. Yeah, that could happen. Ooh, Donkey Kong is who we defeated. Zero. Don yeah, I guess Donkey Kong, who is the one character that's defeated one of these amiibos. Yeah, that's right. We do so. have our highest success rate with Donkey Kong than <laughs> any <laughs> other character. So there you go. Really shows him first. But Jordan, while You'll Derek is getting his. I'm at set. What in yeah. the world? Yeah. Oh my God! You are. This is not going to happen. God. Oh, uh, oh my god, I was like, like, no, no. way. <laughs> Amazing. All right, Just so trick today him three we times. have a question from you M. M says, hey all, my girlfriend and I have been dating for over five years. We're almost done with college, Ooh. and it's okay, time whatever. to start thinking about a wedding. Uh-oh. I have a question, though, about picking my best man. I have Ooh. four really good friends and can't decide how to choose one. One has been like a brother, like my brother since we were born. But since we left high school, we haven't been talking as much. The second I talk to every day, but don't get to see as much because we live on opposite ends of the state. The third I don't talk to as often, but I see and hang out with him more often. And the fourth was my best friend, and he moved to a different state, and we don't talk as much. I just, I don't know how to choose. I'm close to all of them. Help. Oh, boy. So, boy. First of all, the obvious answer, I think you need to hold a feats of strength. <laughs> feats of that strength. is standard. Yes. Feats of strength. Yeah, this like is a, a classic like feats a, of strength. A battle royale a battle meets ro gladiator. That's right. Oh you gosh. need the, you need to buy some swords, some shields, and uh, like a fighting pit. And, yeah, uh, a fighting pit. I but think all, all nerf, please. We don't want anybody getting hurt. I think the rest uh, shall sort itself out. Um, just just based on your very brief descriptions, it sounds like the person you are friends with since birth is the one I would go for. Uh, but. Why is that? Do you think oh, that well, they, they seem to stand the best chance in a in a um, well not necessarily trial of champions, so to speak? <laughs> right, yeah, I just I just have a feeling about them. The way they oh. talked about them was like, ah, oh, they they'd be really good at at fighting. Or or you could go just straight. You know, it's March Madness. We no. got our bracket going yeah, on we over got on Twitter. Bracket. You could just bracket it, you know? Mm, yes. 2v2, 1v1. Yeah. In the end, I think in there's I, an I got 81 percent damage given. And that's the number beat. Okay, is it my turn next? Is that how it goes? Am I, am I at the top of the chart now? Okay, top great. Top of cool. the food it's chain. It's fun. I don't mind. I got it. He's going down. It's going to be, uh, oh boy. Uh, I'm going to go wolf because that's who One I'm going to play a lot with. One of my uh, but, uh, favorite pieces of advice that I've ever heard, and I think it might have even been Jonathan that I heard it from, is in picking 
uh, like bridesmaids or groomsmen. Mm -hmm. uh, it's whoever you want, or not, not even that, who, it's who you invite right. to the wedding. Yes. It's whoever you want to be like in your future rather than like people, right. who, people who have been in your yeah, past. Yeah, don't yeah. invite people just because they've been a part of your past, but because you want them to be a part of your future. So yes. Yes. That's, that's a good rule of thumb just guests. Yeah. Um, yeah. Sure. I think that maybe there might be some argument to that for uh, best man too. Sure. Well, okay. Yeah. So he said that like he had like one particular friend, and maybe I'm going directly against Jay here, but uh, who had been like best friend for a long time, but then like there moved away. There we go. It's like, what is the uh, remaining potential for that to like for that friendship to exist? Um, you know, after after oh. all is said and done. Does that make sense? Like, are you guys going yeah. to like make the time to continue to see each other and like? Oh boy. Go on vacations every year and such, or is it just gonna oh God. slowly fade because of the distance? How'd you just get missed? Uh, awesome. I mean, hmm. is it that big of a, a pressure to pick someone to be your best oh, no! man as opposed to just being in the wedding party? Well, that's the oh, that's the good news is all of these guys can obviously just be in your wedding party anyway. Sure. So. Yeah. So the, I mean, there's there's a lot to be said for that, and and even like I know a lot of people with it, they'll have like the groomsmen, but like they won't have anybody stand up there with them. It'll just be like the bride and you. Yeah. Um, oh sure. And in in that way, it can sort of be like maybe there's the person who's the best planner, and you put them in charge because they're going to be responsible for. Putting together like the bachelor party. There you go. Who do you, which friend yeah, do you think is going to give you that's the right. best bachelor party? That's, that's, that's not an unway. That's not a bad way to do it. In which case, I think you should pick me to be your best man. Yeah, probably. <laughs> but, Ultimately, let's the let's person who will uh, embarrass you the least with their best man speech, or the most, or the most, most depending yeah. on what you're going for. Yeah, you got to you got to think about what who's going to be good at the specific tasks of the best man. Yeah. Yeah. And he said that they've been that he's been dating his girlfriend for five years. So maybe somebody who you've been the closest to in the five years you've been with your girlfriend, or perhaps someone who knew you. Oh before sure, who the knows you the and best as a the couple? Girlfriend. Yeah. Ah, yeah. oh, that's that is that's a really a that's one. a really good way to look at it actually. Yeah, like the who who has been like involved. Um, and so like I'm engaged right now, oh. and so I think the process of like. Ben, I know who your best man is. Yeah, your favorite employee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I understand why you're laughing. <laughs> Jordan is actually Jordan my is the yep. best man. Yeah. Oh man. Um, uh, no. No, uh, but coming. you you say like the the pressure, you know, of like how hard is it to like pick these people? And I would say like picking the groomsmen is one of these things where. Um, like it, it is, it is a challenging thing oh, because no. you have so many people that like. I don't know. It, it does feel like this weird popularity contest you like assign to your life, mm -hmm. and that that feels like a really awkward and strange way to like go about doing things. Uh, so I, I I would be lying if I said that it hadn't consumed some amount of my thought. Um, oh, just go away, you dumb Bowser. Dumb Bowser. You dumb Jowser. Get out of here, Fred. Jowser Jarlin. Kill him once. Oh, could it be? No. Rip his head off. <laughs> I'm trying. You can do oh, I'm it. Dead. I'm dead. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. You know what's super tripping me up though is I'm so used to you being Bowser that I, <laughs> I keep. Know, you're looking at the wrong one. Like, yeah, like I see him like land <laughs> like, I'm like, wait a go. doing great. <laughs> <laughs> this wolf guy is really good. <laughs> oh man, I think the one thing we can be sure of is that I'm going to last the least amount of time against Bowser. Mm. Oh yes! Oh. I got him. Oh. oh my god, I never thought we'd defeat Bowser at all. So this is a huge day. I got hit him again. Yeah, look at that. Take that. Yeah, oh. so now now the thing to beat is uh, killing him once. Yeah. That's awesome. Here we oh! No, I, I feel like he it. might even be able to take on all three of us. Have we beaten him? All three of us, too. We beat him, yeah, we beat him okay. once. Oh, snort. Jeez. Oh, okay. man. You that's know bad. what? I feel like I, that's doable. That felt more doable than Cloud, honestly. Really? Interesting. Like, Oh wow, well that's good to know. He's he's a bigger target. Really. Yeah, sure. You know, sure, sure, sure. Which is nice. Although, boy, you really gotta hit it. He doesn't heal either. The cloud amiibo heals at hundred. Oh, yeah. yeah. It is outrageous. Joe Cloud? Oh. oh. Bowser has no range either. He has to get near you so you can space him a little easier, but Ugh, oh boy. Now watch Ben just crush him. It'll just be it's gonna be a, a one hit wonder. I don't think it's going to be it's a one be a hit one wonder. Hit just wonder. gotta dunk him three times. Just dunk him just three dunk times. Dunk him three times. I have been having in the off season, some amount of luck with 
Pink Eye Link. <laughs> that, that, that is the canon name, I believe. Yes. 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 Name. Boy, I hope if, if and when someone sends us a young Link amiibo, they have nicknamed him Pink Eye Link. Pink Eye Link. And that is the great. Oh, my yeah, well, so you, you have some of the range, which... Oh, there you go. Uh, yeah. Can you imagine a, a, oh my gosh, a young Link amiibo? It would be miserable. Yeah, but be fast. Oh, look out. Um, so far you're winning. So, good, ben. ben, you had been talking about uh, picking a best man, but now that you are playing... Oh, uh, yeah, now, now gonna, all bets are off. I know, yeah. Um, Derek and Jay a little more. Well, so, I, the other thing is, it's not, like, despite the name best man, you can have more than one. Yeah. Um, like, I mean, you probably can't oh, no. have four. Oh, uh, yeah, you yeah. Be, and that's what? that's the thing, like, that uh, the, the, the Carlin bros have done, I guess, historically, is, like... Uh, I was Jay's, like, the person standing next to Jay, but Tyler was also uh, a best man, and Jay yeah, so. was the person standing next to... Oh, no. oh, man, it seemed like I was standing on the platform above him, and that just hit me. Ooh, that was a good hit. Good flame and arrow. <laughs> good, good flame, flame, flame and, and arrow. arrow. <laughs> good good hot hot arrow. great flame and arrow. <laughs> Oh, come that, on, pink guy trying to sink. Uh, oh. you're, you're, you're saying... Uh, oh, great balls of fire is yeah. what I was going for. No! Oh, with that front smash. Oh. So here's that big flash question, footers. because it, it sounds like this, this asker has um, some friends who are located nearby and some friends who are further away. Is there anything to be said for having your your best man be local or far away, or does that not make a difference I, to you? To me, that doesn't really matter. It just depends on the friendship itself. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah I mean, if you're, no matter how far you are, if you're close enough, you make it work. But I think that closer, like someone local would make it easier in a lot of ways. I say this as someone who, you know, uh, has never had a best man. Yeah. <laughs> right, right, so. yeah. Okay, yeah, so what about, like, the, the, the complicated thought? It doesn't sound like this particular person is dealing with this issue, but, like, if you have siblings, but your intention wasn't to pick a sibling. Oh, oh, like, that'd be complicated. Or, or to put, like, a sibling behind one of your friends. I, can, I mean, I can see that if you're, like, if there's, like, a big, big age gap and someone sure. else is clearly your best friend since, you know, you were a kid and, you know. Um, so, a conversation that, that my sister and I had so we have to be the before we have lived to be the in game. the same area <clears throat> was if I were to have gotten married and she was far away, I would want her to be my maid of honor, but also I would want someone close to like do all of the. Oh, what? what? We're not a team. Hold on. Oh, we're not oh. a team. You're right. What about there? Hold on. There it is. Whoops. Weird. We did that last time. We did. Yep. We did. Okay, go ahead, Jordan. Um, just I would want someone who was local to like go dress shopping with me and stuff oh, sure. rather yeah, than yeah. Well, making her fly to where I was and then have to do all of yeah, those so things. And so I would kind of sort of have like. Two, but now she's local. So but to me, I mean, I one of your best friends that you can go dress shopping with. Yeah. Yeah, which is exactly what what our groom needs here. It's exactly. The, be the best yeah. friend you can go dress shopping with. Yeah. I would want to not go dress shopping with a friend, you know. Wait, that you, by you, don't, you don't want to be left out. <clears throat> I, I I wouldn't want to have to dress shop by myself. No, oh, yeah, no, of yeah. course, of course. I'll go dress shopping with you. Would you really? Yeah, oh, of course. Boy. Well, let me tell you, you're currently in the lead for my group. Yes! <laughs> oh, God, I've immediately hit. Wow. Just Im immediately took 29% damage. Yeah. That's so powerful. Launch the projectiles from back there. Okay, just standing there trying to get a hit on Yeah, I'm just trying, just trying to like get a smash in. Um, so... At I actually remember hearing the advice that, that Derek repeated the your wedding is about people you want in your future, not people you just had or something like that. Yeah. Um, can, can we explain that a little bit more? Because I feel like that's one that either warrants repeating or I just don't remember as much as I thought I did. Oh, well, oh. so basically the idea is that, like, you know, it can be really hard to decide who to invite to your wedding. Like, oh, I had a friend who I was friends with from like, you know, six, from like fifth grade through like 12th grade, but now I'm 30 and I haven't seen them in 10 years and I haven't talked to them in four years, but they were a big part of my life. Should I invite them or, you know, are they going to be offended if I don't? And it's just like, are they, are you ever going to be friends with them again? You know, like, are, you know, it's, 
it's okay not to invite that person, even though they were a big part of your life at one point. Right, 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 right. yeah. Whereas, like, you, maybe you have another friend who you just met earlier that year, but you hang out with them every day, and they're really important to you and your new fiance. I was just like, well, yes, they make the cut. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. And that's, that's like, the thing with, like, wedding guests is that, like, when, if and when you, like, you may think, like, oh, I'm going to have a really small wedding, and then you start, like, putting together the numbers. It's like, your wedding invite list is going to explode before you have any idea. Like, right. it's, it's so many more people than you, than you would think. Uh, like, I think Allie and I, across the bridal party, like, she might have, like, <coughs> seven bridesmaids, and I think I have... Jeez. I don't, less uh, groomsmen. <laughs> I'm fewer. <laughs> uh, but like across all the couples and everything, it's just like it's so oh. many people all of a sudden that have to be invited because obviously if it's like if they're your bridal party, they have to be able to bring their date. Right. right. Um, um, yeah, that, that makes sense. So on the flip side then, if you get invited to someone's wedding or if you go to someone's wedding who <coughs> maybe you haven't been as close to lately, do you feel like there's some sort of obligation to like maintain that friendship more than you had been? No, this is my rule. It's not a rule for everyone. It's just, you know, this is, this is how I, this is the advice I give when people don't we know. We can't her twice. Uh -huh. Well, this we beat doable. him. We're going to beat him, I think. Like as a, as a team, we can take him. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Three. Nah, that's going to be really embarrassing. Um... Mm -hmm. It's just like if people are having trouble, I find this to be a good rule of thumb because it can be overwhelming, like eh, about you, and you can feel very guilty about not inviting people or whether or not you should invite people. Oh yeah, it, it's really weird how like it's always described as like your special day, and then you start getting into it, and it's like, well, Aunt Susie and whoever need to be included in this because of whatever, and it's like all of a sudden everybody's input comes from every direction, and it's like. I thought this was my special day. Right. Oh, but more realistically, Alice's special right. day. Yeah. Just show up and Try not say to, the right words. Well, Try not I to hope mess that anything it's special up. for you two. Oh. Um, oh, yeah. No. There, there is no scenario where it isn't amazing. So, uh... Nice! Woo! The final kill. The final <laughs> kill. I just kept on doing smash attacks. <laughs> I was like, yeah. thum, thum, I thum, will thum. hit you. Woo! He did knock out uh, more than half of your guys' collective lives, though. Uh, what a Dorcas. Derek, did you get him? Oh, no, Ben got him once in Derek. Yeah, I got him. I, I thought I got him for two times, actually, so apparently Ben got him once now. Oh, man. But, Jay, you said that you thought beating Bowser was doable. I do think it's doable. I think we can beat him. I think we can beat him. We just gotta, uh... Like, I, the Amiibos like, are so tough. They are. They're really tough. It's a really good challenge. It is. It is, definitely. Like, I think... We were, Jay and I were saying, like, if you got to the point where you could, like, regularly beat any of them, you would be very good against, like, any right. of your friends. Well, I feel like I've been playing so much against that Cloud character, or Cloud Amiibo, and I went online the other night with Wolf, and I was just like, oh, whoa, I am significantly better than I thought. Sure. <laughs> yeah, With yeah. this character, suddenly. Um, and Wolf? just, like, learning how to, like, because you, like... Pick up a lot of the same tendency. Boy, if someone played me as Cloud, I don't think they could score. I don't think they even touch me. Do you remember when we were doing the 3v5 challenge and at first we thought that was difficult? Yes. <laughs> that seems like a cinch at this point. I know, yeah, right. 3v5. <laughs> what a joke. Hilarious. Well, there you go, guys. We, we made another good run at uh, Jowser, but we do not get to add another uh, amiibo to the to the winner shelf. To, to our wall of... Yeah, of emptiness. You are a shelf one. with a Samus amiibo on it. <laughs> <laughs> it's such an empty shelf. It is a, yeah, we were Why like, did oh, we get such a big one? Why did we get such a big shelf? We were such fools. Anyway, uh, uh, thank you so much. Uh, I can't wait to uh, hear from you guys all again. Uh, next Monday's episode where we take on another Amiibo. Uh, in the meantime, make sure you leave us some comments and questions, like uh, anything you need advice on in the towel section down below. And make sure you're tuning in for the Nuzlocke every Wednesday and Friday. Yeah. yeah. But probably until next time. Charlie Cannons, Charlie Cannons, boom, 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 we, we are not pirates. pirates.